Welcome to Army Aviation Officer Candidate Test Prep SIP Test Online Lesson Series. In this lesson, we'll go over spatial apperception for your SIP test. So before you start, make sure that you have a notebook and a pen so you could write some very important information for the video that will help you to prepare for the test. As always, pause the video and study by yourself, make sure that you understand the concept and then download this application called SIP Tutoring app from App Store and Google Play. It has way more um, the practice test that will help you to prepare for the test. So let's get started. So in this lesson, we'll go over aircraft turns left or right, the aircraft ascending or descending, aircraft is approaching land, sea, or going along shoreline. So before we start, let's get an uh, overview exactly what we will be doing in here. This section of SIP test aims to assess your ability to picture an aircraft in the three-dimensional space and understand how cockpit view corresponds with the aircraft position. In this section, you need to identify series of cockpit view and match with the external view of an aircraft in a flight and which way the aircraft is based on the cockpit view. You could see the cockpit view in here and this is the external view. To pass this section, you need to envision the view of the cockpit depending on the aircraft position relative to the external geography. You have only 10 minutes to answer 25 questions. So let's learn some uh, terminology, okay, some uh, basic concept. So make sure that you understand. So uh, first we'll learn level flight, climbing or descending, right? The position of the horizon indicates, so this is the position of the horizon and this is the position of the aircraft, okay? Uh, whether the plane is climbing, descending or in level flight. Now, if the horizon is in the middle of the image, so you see in the middle of the image, um, the aircraft is in uh, level flight. So that means it's not going up or going down or left or right. This is called level flight. Next one is uh, if the horizon is lower in the image, the aircraft is climbing. So you could say this is lower, right? And it, it seems like aircraft is um, going upward. That means the aircraft is climbing. The next is if the horizon is higher in the image. You see your horizon is in the higher on the image. So that means the aircraft is descending. You could look at this image is going downward. The next, if the aircraft is banking left or right. So you could see here, if the horizon is inclined to the right, so you could see here inclined to the right, so that means the aircraft is banking to the left. So you see here this, this direction that the aircraft is going to that direction, um, banking to the left. Now, if the horizon is inclined to the left, the aircraft is banking to the right, the same way. So you could see here this is the inclined, the um, is to the left, and that's why the aircraft is moving to the right. So now you practice here. So the picture that best represent the same aircraft point view from a outside. If you look at the horizon, what you could see here, you see here, this is inclined um, to the right, right? So that means inclined to the right means um, it is moving to the, um, it is taking a left banking. So you could see uh, that is the best option. And the, most of them are um, is a different direction that doesn't make any sense. Now let's do some practice here. You could see here um, the horizon is inclined to the right. So you could see um, the best answer for this is answer is letter a so that means is right inclined it is mixed um, and it also um, to the middle so that means the level flight and also uh, making a uh, left turn so the next example is 
is inclined, right? And also um, is in the in the middle, is not in the down. The horizon is not down. So that means the um, that is a level flight, right banking, C on the left. You could see a C on the left. So that means this represent C, right? So what is the answer option? The answer option is letter E. The next one is so the picture the best represent the same aircraft when be from outside, right? So you could see here the horizon, right? So that means um, the level flight, right banking in the into the land. So it is going into the land. The correct answer is B. Another example here. So the aircraft um, from the picture that best represent the same aircraft when the view from the outside. You could see here it is um, in the horizon on the top, right? Horizon on the top. So that means um, the aircraft is descending, right? So you could see here the aircraft is descending. The correct answer is um, B and uh, along with the shoreline. So because this is in, in, in between, between uh, land and um, C. So there are few practice so you try by yourself so you could see here um, the horizon on the upper side in the image so what that is mean so that means upper means it is going to the downward so that is the correct answer option. So there are a few practice you try by yourself make sure that you understand okay. Um, and then um, download this application called SIP Tutoring app from App Store or Google Play. It has more practice tests. Practice those that will really help you to prepare for that um, special perception uh, section in the test. And also it has the prediction test that kind of tells you if you're ready to take the actual test or not. Okay. Thank you.